Praise the Lord and greetings everyone in the matchless name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Grace and peace be multiplied unto you through our Lord Jesus. My name is Bishop Horace C. Michael and it is my humble honor to serve as the chairman of the Founders Day Committee of the Church of our Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostolic Faith Incorporated. In this humble capacity, God has allowed me to come into a position to help to promote and perpetuate the cherished memory of the establishmentarian of our organization, Bishop Robert Clarence Lawson. This year, our Founders Day service will be in-house on Friday, May the 5th at 7.30 at the Greater Refuge Temple in Harlem, New York. We want every one of you to be there with us to celebrate the memory and the impact and the legacy of Bishop Lawson. In addition to this day, there's a host of things God has put in my spirit for a broader vision for our future Founders Day events. At a high level, God has instructed us to create what will be known as the Lawsonian Registry. This registry will contain individuals who have been pastored by Bishop Lawson. We will put together a commemorative certificate that will be given to them in a future Founders Day service to memorialize the fact that they have been pastored by our great establishment area. But it goes on further than that. We're also going to provide, provide an opportunity to memorialize individuals pastored by Bishop Lawson who actually have passed away so that we can take advantage not only of their memories, but also to reach out to their family members in an attempt to bring them to salvation. The intent of our vision is not only to share information, but to save souls, to promote salvation. There are so many other aspects that we will be taking into account. For example, we're going to put together an entrepreneurial workshop, remembering the great entrepreneurial and business works of Bishop Lawson to help to perpetuate those skills and interests within our organization. We're also going to investigate how we can get Bishop Lawson's books back in circulation. Not only his profound literature that shows depth of scholarship, but even Bishop Lawson's songbook, Songs of Christ, those pearls and jewels of poetic wisdom that were captured in lyrics that were made songs. We want you to know those songs, to learn them and to sing them to the glory and the honor of God. We've got so many other things in store, but one last thing I wanna share with you. In our future Founders Day celebration, we're gonna have a banquet. Yes, indeed, it's gonna be time to get dressed up, where we honor those incredible heroes and sheroes that have helped to perpetuate Founders Day for many, many years. Yes, we will be honoring Bishop Whitaker Wright, Bishop that was leading this as the chairman of the Founders Day Committee before myself. We will tell him thank you for his years of service. And even by his side, the incomparable Dr. Celeste S. Johnson, who served as the CEO of the Founders Day for decades. We want her to know that we love her and we thank her for her efforts. But last but not least, Bishop Dr. Robert C. Spellman, the historian of Cool JC. Who else has done such a Herculean job at chronicling in written and digital form the great works and memories of Bishop Lawson? We want to tell these individuals how much we love them and thank them for their years of service, how they have yet added thou to it. And so remember, Friday, May 5th, 2023, we will have our annual Founders Day service. And guess what? That's actually Bishop Lawson's birthday. So I look forward to seeing you there. Come one, come all. And there's more in store. God bless you in Jesus' name.